Hi, I'm Mackenzie from Mr. Rice's Room, and I read this book called Out of My Mind by Sharon Draper, and um, this book is about a girl named Melody Brooks, who is 11 years old. She's a special needs kid, so she goes to a special needs room, um, and she, like, she can't walk, she can't talk, and she can't, like, do anything, really, so she's... But she's the smartest kid in the school, but she doesn't know that. So when, um, she goes to an academic contest, um, but everybody's making fun of her because she's a special needs kid. Um, this book really reminds me of my sister because Melody isn't afraid to speak up, and so is my sister, Lucy. So that's who Melody reminds me of. Bye. Hi, everybody. This book is called Cinderella Smith, and it is a um, just a nice book. Um, story, kind of a heartwarming, humorous story about a girl named Cinderella. And of course she gets a little bit of flack because that's kind of a strange first name to have. Um, and in fact Cinderella in this story we find out right, right away that she loses um, some of her friends, that um, kind of her friends sort of turn their back on her and she's sort of shut out and left kind of all by herself. She ends up uh, making a new friend um, but still has to deal with these friends that aren't being, her former friends that aren't being very nice to her. And actually one of her former friends is trying to prevent Cinderella from um, having the lead in a tap dance recital that's coming up. So Cinderella has to um, deal with some of this, um, uh, some of these problems and overcome them. So it's really a nice story about perseverance and kind of rising up and um, you know, dealing with some problems and overcoming them. So it's a nice story. Again, there's some humor in here, nice realistic fiction. There's some good um, good pictures inside, some good illustrations. So I think this would be a good one, kind of a quick read, um, a nice uh, fun book to add to your list of Mod Heartless um, Book Award nominees. Hello, hello. my name is Lavina. You should read the book Night, The Night Fairy because it is about a night fairy named Flory, and she wants to become a day fairy. Flory does not know everything a night fairy should know. I think this book is good because she makes friend, friends with a squirrel and a bat. The end. Hello, my name is Ben and I read the book The Trouble with Chickens. This book is about a dog who meets a mother chicken and the mother chicken wants to find her two babies. Read this book to find out where she finds, where they get find the babies. I like this book because it's funny and adventurous and it also is a, is an easy book for me. Hi, my name is Yunju, and this book um, is called Turtle in Paradise, and it's by Jennifer L. Holm, um, and it's a Newbery Honor book, and the thing I liked about this book was it was really exciting, and it told how it told, um, the author told how it, um, it felt about leaving home, because the main character is Turtle, and her mom, she um, she has a job of housekeeping for a woman that doesn't really like children. So Turtle has to leave her mom and has to go to Key West, which is in Florida. And she never, like, she has to go to relatives that she never met before. And I really like this book because um, Turtle, um, I, I think she was really, like, she was really, like, nervous when she, like, first came to Key West, but then later she built up her confidence and she goes on many adventures with her relatives, and I guess that's it. Hey everybody, Mr. Cry here. Mike Steller, Nerves of Steel, is a fun science fiction adventure story that is one of the nominees for Mod Heart Loveless. Um, it is about Mike who within eight hours, only within eight hours notice, his parents tell him, we are moving to Mars. So Mike has eight hours to pack up and his whole life is gonna change as his family is moving to a colony on Mars. Um, Mike is pretty upset about this. Um, adding to his frustration is his least favorite teacher is also joining them on their space adventure up to Mars. So he's not very happy about that. Um, what Mike realizes once he gets to the colony on Mars is that nothing is what it seems. 
and that there's a lot of strange secrets and that he can tell that adults are keeping secrets. Even his parents, he can tell are keeping secrets from him. He meets some other kids and they start to try to figure out exactly what's going on. He learns um, something by going into a restricted area that he's not supposed to go into. And he also starts piecing together some clues of a mysterious lost spaceship. So it's kind of a nice little mystery story as well. So Mike Steller, Nerves of Steel, um, great addition to the Mod Heart Loveless Book Award list of nominees. So remember, in order to vote in March, you must read three, at least three books from the, from the Mod Heart Loveless list in your division. This would be division one. And um, to get a book, come to the library, visit Hennepin County. Um, and if you're not finding the book you want, you can place the book on hold either in the library or on your Destiny Quest app. All right, you guys, hope you're doing a lot of reading and get those books read so you can vote in March. All right, take care.